I've actually been teaching Managing in the Future since about 1997, when I was a professor at Wake Forest University. And so, you know, people always ask, you know, first of all, how do you teach a course on things that hasn't happened yet, right? Which is the first thing that comes to your mind, right? Is it all about predictions? Is it all about just a trend extrapolation? And some people are just really interested in the future. I'm one of those. I was always interested in what happens next. You know, students learn the fundamentals of accounting, the fundamentals of marketing, operations, strategy, CIS. You learn your fundamental basic skills of what an MBA education has to, op uh, has to offer. The thing that happens, however, when you've got your head down, you can't really look up and see what else is going on. And so what my course is designed to do and, and, and which is developed over time is to help students to be able to see relationships that they otherwise wouldn't see. How can you expect students to keep up with evolving social, political, economic, and technological trends at the rate that they're going and still study? It's just, it's not possible. It's, it, you know, for me, when I'm preparing to teach the course, which I teach it differently every time, I never teach it the same way. Now, there's some fundamental principles about it that are the same, but uh, I never teach it the same way because how could you? Basically, what you're trying to do is develop a method, a way of trying to um, bring information to students that they can find to be useful, that they otherwise wouldn't get a chance to do. And, you know, because the world of the future is evolving all the time, you think about what's happening in artificial intelligence, changes in demographics, the role that uh, social media is playing, um, how all these things evolving around identity, for example. But ultimately, what I'm trying to do is take the theoretical out of the future and make it practical so that you actually have to make a decision. See, it's really easy to make a decision when, you, when you've got most of the facts. Well, who can't answer that? But that's not the way the world works. That's not the way the future works. Most of the time, it's all gray. You will come up with situations that you've never seen before, and then what do you do then? So that's what this course is about. What do you do then? Think about managing a leading from a dashboard. That, that's the way to think about leading, metrics. Looking at that and constantly making adjustments based upon new data, new information, new things that you never thought about before. These things affect business. And that's kind of like the, what I'm hoping to do in the course, is to get students to get more comfortable with ambiguity and get to examine how people make decisions in the face of great uncertainty.